Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. How you guys doing? I know I haven't put up any like videos up in a while except for maybe two videos, two or three videos. I think two or three. I don't know which how many of them are right now. But I put up quite a few right now. But um yeah, I know I haven't been here in a while. Cause this new year has been very hectic. But I am trying to continue to go strong doing my YouTube because I really enjoy it and I really love doing it. But with so much going on, it's like very hard for me to do it. But yeah, um, so, but anyway, this is not what this video is about. So this video is a shop my stash, um, shop my stash for the month of January. So basically, I, each month I'm going to go in and use different products. The products that I have picked out and chose to use for the um for that month, I'm just going to use it only in that month. So yeah, I'm trying to make sure that I have everything and enough stuff to go through for the whole month. And I got this idea from um just Diona. I put her name right here, and I also will put down the link to her so you can be able to check it out. I'm gonna give credit due where credit is due, where I got the idea from. So I don't know where it originated, but that's who I got the idea from. But um, yeah, you guys, I hope you guys enjoy this this shop my stash that I'm coming up with, and I'm really enjoying it. And then I'm am doing makeup tutorial tutorials. Hold on. And then I'm doing makeup looks that I'm using in the shop my stash and this is happened to be one of them. I did this makeup look, I recorded everything so be on the lookout for that. That should be coming in a few days so I hope you guys enjoy this look too. But I'm going to show you everything that I have. Let's get right into it. So the first thing that I have for this month is primer and the first thing I'm using is this Black Radiance True Complex Shine Control Primer. I don't know if you can see that or not. But, oh yeah, just FYI, if you're wondering if something is different, yes it is. I am in another part of my room um, doing the videos now. So the lighting may be a little different off or I don't know is how the lighting is. Because I really can't see because I don't have a mirror behind me. So, but yeah, I just want to let you know that yeah, it is different. So... Yeah, but anyway, there is the Black Radiance True Complex Shine Control Primer, and then I have the Elf Poreless Face Primer. I wanted to go ahead and just use these because these are the least of my favorite primers, but I'm going to use them together. So next, going on to eyebrows, I have three things from the shop my stash from the eyebrows thing I'm using. First one is the Elf Eyebrow Kit. Y'all see me use this all the time. This is in the color medium. I'm halfway done with this one, so I want to go ahead and use it, but Wet and Wild um, Eyebrow Pencil, just basically like this. I only have this much of it left, so yeah. And then the last thing I just discovered, so well, I've been, I've been had it, but um, I forgot to get to put the top back on, but I've been have it, had it, but I haven't used it, because it was, it's a e.l.f. mineral eyeliner. And this is how it looks like, but it's in the color coffee, and it's a brown color. But this is just using the e.l.f. Complete Coverage Conceal. This is the only thing I have for the eyelids, for the eye, um, cleaning up my eyebrows. This is basically all I use. So this is all that I'm just going to use for then. This is going to be in there every month. Going on into eyeshadow primers, I am using the Ion Cosmetic. This was absolutely my favorite eyeliner eyeshadow primer and this is the eight hour wear going on into eyeshadow base i have two eyeshadow base and these are i think these are the only two i have do i i know i think it's another one in there but these are the first one is the maybelline color take two i don't know the name of this one because the name is not on here but this one has look i got this one when it was in the dollar tree the other one i have is this elf um Smudge pot in the color brownie points, and I don't know if I ever um, show you guys me using this. I think I did on this. I don't know what happened. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I mean, yes, I did. Yes, I did show you guys. I don't remember what video it was in. So yeah. So let's move on into eyeshadows. I do have quite a few. Um, first, we're gonna start with the single ones. I have like three of them. I'm going to use the LA Color Shimmer Loose Eyeshadow. 
The brown one's in the color Radiant, and the white one's in the color Snow White. Another one that I'm using is the ColourPop Mittens, in the color Mittens, and this is how it looks like. I'm moving on to eyeshadow palettes. I do have a few. The first one is the Elf in the color Purple Party. And this one of these quads, purple ones. I got this one, actually, I got this one for free. It came with a little, um, another eyeshadow primer that, I mean, not sh eyeshadow that I have is the e.l.f. And I, like I said, I got these e.l.f. palettes like this in a holiday collection. And this one is in the new collection. And, um, it's in a new palette. And this is how it looks like. I hope you guys can see that. I thought it was a really pretty palette, I mean, yeah, palette to play around with because I really want to try this color. This color really caught my eye. It's like a, um, purplish, a purple brown looking color. So, yeah, I'm going to play around with this palette and see if I like it. Another eyeshadow palette is the Elf Big Eyeshadow Palette. And this is NYC, I don't know. I think this way it said it's on NYC, but this is how it looks like. I think I got this one for free too. I think yeah, I think I got this one for free too. And this is how this palette looks like. Um, I actually have this color right here, the broken one on my lid. I haven't really, and this or actually my first time using this palette. I've been having this palette for a while, and it's just been sitting there, and I never really used it. So I decided to go ahead and use it this month and play around with it, and yeah. I so the last eyeshadow palette I have is the Pride, Prejudice, and Zombie um, Eyes and Cheek Palette from BH Cosmetics. And this is and this is the other palette that I use, another palette that I use to finish this look too. So yeah, I bought this palette. Y'all probably remember my BH Christmas, not my Christmas, but my birthday haul or whatever one of these things was. I bought this palette, but it's just been sitting there. I haven't really used it, and I decided to go ahead and use it. So yeah. Next we have is some liquid eyeliner, and the first one I use is in the Ayana Cosmetic. I think this is the only one I have because I really don't have that many. I think I have three, but i just been... I actually am in love with this eyeliner. I just wish they make it into something that I'm used to seeing. Maybe into a pen form. I want to try that. Or I want to try it in the liquid kind. Like, not the liquid kind. Because this is liquid. But the cream kind. The one you use the brush with. But, um, I really, really like it. Because it's, like, super intense black. It looks like this. But it's, like, intense black. Like, i never seen an eyeliner that intense of black. And speaking of eyeliner, I have two other ones. And this one is the Black Radiance um, Professional Eyeliner Pencil. I got this one a while back, a while, a while back. And I just, it's just been sitting there. I think I really don't like this one. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I'm probably just going to give it away. I throw it away. I don't know because I'm, it really doesn't do anything for me. One I use today is the Rimmel London um, Waterproof Eyeliner, and it looks like this. It's retractable, and it has a smudge a bottom on the bottom. So those are my two eyeliners that I have. Now going on to mascara, I only have two mascara that I'm using. The first one is the Wet n Wild Mega Wear Mascara. And I think I used, yeah, I used this one today. And the other one I have is the Mega, the Wet n Wild Mega Length. And now this one is my favorite because it does give my eyelashes a length. And I say favorite, so funny. <laughs> Let's move on to eyelashes. Now the first eyelashes that I have are the J Lash Natural Hair. I just recently got this last year from Fresh in um, February, December. Yeah, December. So when I was Christmas shopping, I found these, and I actually have them on now. But the thing about them, I don't know if I really like them. They are pretty lashes or whatever, but right now, this eyelash is about to come off, and I don't know why. Like, they, the glue is good, because I didn't use the glue plenty of times, so the glue should be perfect. But this eyelash is, is just, I don't know. Yeah. Another eyelash is, is the eBay eyelashes that I got. So, these are the eBay lashes. These were my first eBay lashes that I bought. And I stopped using them because they were super thin. And I was getting used to having thicker lashes. So, I stopped using them because they were super thin. And now I'm going to reuse them. But this time, I'm going to stack them. 
I'm going to try stacking them on each other and see how that works. So moving on to foundation. I actually have two foundations that I wanted to go ahead and use this month. The first one is the Black Radiance Mocha Honey Foundation, which is actually the one I use today. Um, I've been having this one for a while and it's a very... I like to have the applicator right here, which makes it applying onto your face much easier instead of using, putting it on the back of your hand or um, putting it on your brush. So I kind of like that. The other one I have is the Maybelline Matte Poreless Foundation, the Fit Me one. And this is in the color 355 Coconut. Now, I've been having this one for a while too, and I want to go ahead and use it before, you know, it gets bad or anything like that. But I want to go ahead and use it and do, um, I want to purchase another one. So, yeah. Now, I'm going moving on to concealer. The first concealer, which I always forget to use, and I just bought it, is the LA Girl Pro Concealer um, Color Corrector and the orange, well, the orange Color Corrector. The other one I have is the LA Girl Pro Concealer. In the color cool tan um i want to go ahead and use this on uh, up because i have a backup of a backup of this one but it's almost through so i want to go ahead and just go and use it up so another one i have is the elf lightweight concealer stick i got purchased this from elf a while back and this is how it looks like I Next, for setting, I mean, for setting my concealer, I'm using the Maybelline Master Fix um, Setting Perfect Perfecting Perfecting Loose Powder. For face press powder, I only have two, and this one is the one that I've been using the most, and this is the Elf Toffee one. So I've been using this one. I kind of don't really want to go ahead and hit pan on it, so. So, the next thing I want to talk about is the contour palette. Contour and highlight. And I'm using the Black Radiance True Complex Contour Palette in Medium to Dark. And I'm just using this palette as my contour and my highlight palette. I said, why not just use this as one? You get the best of both worlds. Next is the e.l.f. Blush Palette. I only have like two different palettes, but I have like four blushes. Uh, because this one has four different blushes. And I'm just going to use this palette and play around with. But the color that I'm really, really been using this month of January is this one. I really been loving this mauve looking color right here let's move on to lips i have three lip um liners the first one is the um nikki k in the color nuts and actually i have used this one today another one is the nikki k auto retract the pencil in the color plums plum yeah in the color plum that's how it looks like And another one that I have is the Elf Lip Liner and Blending Brush. And I got this one as a free gift too. And this one is in the color red. It's not a red red. But it's, let me see. I don't know if I have some wash on that. But it's not like a red red color. Now moving on to a Lips product. I am not using any matte liquid lipstick in this one because lately I've been noticing how you know it's cold the weather been kind of the weather cold weather is dry things out and lately it's been drying out my liquid lipstick I mean yeah it's been drying even more on my liquid lipstick and I don't like how the way my lips be looking and the first one is in the Santine liquid lipstick combo and this is in the color the thing just came off 11 it has 11 a number 11 I think I got this from shop miss a and it's a real pretty color another lip combination is the la girl lipstick and gloss duo in the color flush and i actually only have this much to go because i have been using this when i first got it but i stopped another one that i have is the color pop i don't know what the name of it because they don't have no name on here but um it's called Nevermind, and it's in a matte liquid matte not matte liquid I don't know the name of the thing, the color. I don't know what you call these things, but y'all yeah, know. It's the name of the color is never mind. It's matte and it's a, a purple look. Next, I have two lip gloss. The first one is called Wine and Dine. It's actually what I have on my lips. 
on top of my lips and this one how it looks and it's from bh cosmetics the other one that i have is the la glaze lip paints and i don't know the name of this one but it's a dark color now the last four i have is lipstick the other one, first one i have is the elf moisturizer lipstick in the color nude in the nude and actually that's why i have on my lips too three i have three lip things on here this another one that i buy um that i got using is the marcella brush the marcella blush and this is the elf lily um moisturizing lipstick i'm so used to saying liquid lipstick and this one is this how this one looks like I will the last two are joanna lipstick and i've been having these for a while and i just never used them and the first one, and these are the modern, the modern matte lipstick. And the first one is called Matte Dare. And this is how it looks like. But the last one is the Matte Gorgeous. Gorgeous. And this one, and this is how it looks like. I'm also going to be including fragrances in this. So the first two are body spray fragrances, body mist fragrances. The first one is um, by Bath and Body Works, Warm Vanilla Sugar. I actually have a little bit, it's right down here, left of this, and I really want to go ahead and get rid of it. So I just go ahead and use it for the whole month of January. Another one is the Pink Heart Crush Body Mist and, yeah, the Pink Heart Crush and Body Mist by Victoria's Secret and I just want to go ahead and use that up too. For my perfume, I'm going to be using this um, Only Me Passion Perfume that my husband got me from the mall. So I don't know what it's really from but it's like, it said it's made in France. It has an expiration date of 2018 so next year and the end of De December 2018 it will be gone you guys that is it i'm tired of talking my voice is hurting i'm through so i hope you guys like this video get this video a thumbs up comment down below um don't forget to check out just the on um page channel with her sh shopper stash and i hope this wasn't too too long but yeah you guys happy new year's happy martin luther king day and i just want to say Thank you for supporting my channel and giving my channel to 400 subscribers now. I'm really excited. My head is itching. But yeah, you guys, um, like this video. Give this video a thumbs up and comment down below. And be on the lookout for this look. Now I'm about to go and take these eyelashes off. I'll holler at you guys. Peace and much love.